And dedicated of you, what happened with Mike? She must have hated that. Yeah, this one. You traveled all the way home to walk your sister to school. It was only a dozen light years. Oh, like yeah, only a dozen light years. Like it was going to Earth or something. My last day out, Mike was waiting for us. Sarah had told her friends, so everyone at school knew what he did. He wasn't happy. I wanted to snap him in half, but Sarah gave me this look. This, let me handle it. I need to do this alone look. Okay. She cool, God bless her, as he screamed in her face. She just let him vent. Then he tried to punch her. Uh-oh. I swear, she just flowed around him. Next thing I knew, he's face down on the sidewalk, and there's blood everywhere. Uh, wow. He didn't hurt her. Uh, she hit him. Yeah, wow. That's Dusty. Sarah must Stop be it. You. Better. I'm more or less a straight-up puncher. <laughs> when he swung, she just... She wasn't there anymore, and he fell. <laughs> she helped him stop the bleeding and had me call an ambulance. She told the paramedics he fell. Well, that's Before pretty true. The hospital, Mike touched Sarah's arm. I thought he was going to end up on the ground again. <laughs> but he hung his head, whispered, I'm sorry, and started crying. Aww. And she hugged him. The Williams women are a decisive bunch, Commander. We do things when we're ready. Not before, not after. Good for you. Interesting story. Where was your father? This was pointless. Interesting story. Your sister's something else. But you didn't mention your father at all. Was he on deployment? Dad always wanted to serve in space. But he wanted us to have real ground under our feet. He'd say, space is beautiful, but you can't raise a family there. Mm hmm? I cannot rest from travel. I will drink life to the lees. Oh my god. All times <laughs> I have enjoyed greatly, have suffered greatly, both with those that loved me and alone. For always roaming with a hungry heart, much have I seen. Ashley, you can stop. <laughs> of men and manners, climates, councils, governments. Uh, you read poetry. Bored now. A <laughs> shepherd. Um, I've always liked that one, Tennyson, right? What's this crap? <laughs> uh, this one. I never thought I'd hear you reciting poetry. Just because I can drill you between the eyes at a hundred meters doesn't mean I can't like sensitive stuff. I didn't say that. Still spread it around. <laughs> Ulysses was my dad's favorite poem. Every time he shipped out, he recorded me reading it. He had a dozen versions when he retired. It's a good piece. Really? Sounds dull. Now let's appease her. Does he still like it? I sure hope so. I read it to his grave every time I go home. Dad passed on a few years back. He's probably still watching, though. From the afterlife watching? Yeah, sure he is. Uh... This one? You mean from wherever we go after death? Dead on, Skipper. He's with God now. That's not a problem with you, is it? That I believe in God? I do too. Keep it to yourself. Of course not. Not my place to judge. Are you a fanatic? Uh, no, it doesn't bother me at all. Everyone has the right to believe what they want. It says so in the Alliance Charter. Only with fancier words. I'm glad you're open-minded about it. I've met a few people who are really weirded out by my faith. Because I work in space, I can't believe in a higher power. Jeez. Hello, have you people looked out the window? How can you look at this galaxy and not believe in something? Ashley, you can stop. I should get back to my duties. Didn't mean to take up so much of your time. Okay, then. Uh, goodbye. Dismissed, Chief. Ma'am. All right. Sounds good. Uh, I'll be back in just one moment. Sorry about that. Went to give my guinea pigs some food, so hopefully they'll stop squeaking now. Hi, Rex. What do you want, Shepard? Oh, Invest no, we've already gone through those. Personal inquiry. Why did you become a mercenary? Lots of reasons. Yes, like elaborate. Uh yeah? Such as Such as I needed to get out of our system. I needed to eat. I needed to survive. Why leave? Goodbye. <laughs> no, this one. Why not stay and help your people? I tried to help. That's why I had to leave. Really? Interesting. Uh, really? What happened? I was betrayed. Oh no. I was head of a small tribe. We were trying to restore order after the war. But the other tribes were against us. They followed Jared, one of the few warlords who survived the war with the Turians. But he was old 
and so were his ideas. Okay. He wanted to continue the war. He wanted us to fight. Turians, Solarians, each other. It didn't matter who, as long as we were fighting. Okay then, uh, <laughs> that sounds bad. What about you and this one? What did you want? I just wanted Jared to shut up. <laughs> to stop his ranting. I wanted him to stop leading the tribes astray. But he couldn't understand how much things had changed. We didn't have the numbers to go to war. Even if we did, the genophage made sure we couldn't replenish our numbers fast enough. Mm -hmm. We told them all to forget about war. We needed to focus on breeding. At least for one generation. Yeah, that makes sense to and me. for a while, we were getting through. Some of the tribes started coming around. What about Jared? Well, Shepard, I'm pretty sure you should be able to see where this is going by now. I take it the warlord didn't appreciate that. Yeah, that's no, better. <laughs> he didn't. He arranged a crush with the tribes. A meeting on neutral ground. He wanted to talk. We met at the Hollows, near the graves of our ancestors. The skulls of our dead laid bare to remind us where we come from and where we all go. It's as sacred as any Krogan place can be. Violence is forbidden. Uh-huh. <laughs> I think I see where this is going. And you went, that's risky. Uh, this one? Sounds like a trap to me. You must have suspected as much. I did. But when your father invites you to oh. crush well... Lots there of detail you left out. We hold sacred. Your father? What? Uh, this one? Jared was your father? He was. Until that day. We talked. But we didn't get anywhere. When it was clear that I wouldn't join him, he gave the signal. Uh oh. His men leapt from the graves of our ancestors like Krogan undead. The few that were loyal to me died quickly. What about you? I escaped with my life. But not before I sank my dagger deep into my father's chest. That is why I left. And that's why I'll never go back. Investigate. I see. <laughs> Investigate. Wait. Family? You must have family other than your father. Don't you miss them? You're trying to make me cry, okay. Shepard. No. I think I've that would be some futile. Unfinished business with my family. But that's all. Really? Go on, get to the point. Uh, sure. What kind of business? <sighs> Before I left, I made an oath to my father's father. I swore to recover my family's battle armor. It was taken from him after the uprising. Armor. Where is it? Uh, this one? Who has it? Originally, it was taken by the Turian military. We weren't allowed armor or weapons after the war. Mm-hmm. Now, it's in the hands of Ton Actus, a Turian scum who collects relics from the war. He's made millions selling Krogan artifacts that were stolen from my people. Oh dear. He's got several bases where he stores his goods. All fortified and guarded. I just don't know which base has my family's armor. Mmm, I see. Okay, uh, I'll look for it. Just tell me where to start looking. I'll upload the data to your nav system. But Commander... I want to be there when you find him. Don't worry about it. Good. So long, Rex. Shepard. Bye bye. Okay. Uh, let me see. Who do we? We've got Tally and Caden left. Oh dear. Here we go. Chatty Corian. Hopefully she won't take too long. Ah, uh, hi, Tally. Shepard, I'm glad you're here. Glad you're feeling better. You seem happy. What's going on? Uh, you seem happy. Good to see you smiling again, so to speak. <laughs> I'm sleeping much better now. I guess I'm getting used to how quiet your ship is. That's good. But I don't want this to get in the way of our mission, Shepard. First we stop Seren. Then I'll worry about my own problems. Oh, hey. Okay. That was really short. I should go. 
See you later. Okay, well, goodbye. <laughs> that was quick. Alright, so we've got Caden left, and, um... I don't know. I don't really want to equip stuff. Well, maybe I'll, I'll equip armor. I don't really care about the rest. Let's see, Ashley. Uh, is any of this better than what you have on? I don't think so. My god, I'm getting so much stuff for her. This one is a little less damage protection, but more shields. Hmm. Alright, well, let's see what this is. Shield modulator 4. Shield modulator 5! And there you go. And let's upgrade this if we can. Oh my. I'm pretty sure that's worse than what Rex has on, so you can have it. Okay. You're done. Uh, let's see. Okay, Caden should be good. Let's go to Garrus. Garrus. Yeah, that's worse than yours. Okay. Uh, shield bonus. Uh, sure, take that. Go for it. Um, we'll give you a better sniper rifle. Yeah, go for it. And this is better than what you have, so you can have that. Oh, wait, I forget to check this. What do you have? First aid interface 2? Dude, that sucks. You can have a better one. Like this. There you go. Okay, Rex should be good. Tally. Still haven't found any armor for her. This is kind of ridiculous. Tech cooldown, but no, you can have tech cooldown bonus is a good idea. Um, how about these? Okay, let's start with this one, and then I'll go through again and see if anything is better. Nope. Okay. Um, well, she doesn't really do well with those. Let's give her a better shotgun, though. Whoa, that one's pretty good. But I'll give her this one because I don't think. Let me see Rex. Is this better? Yeah. I want him to have the better one. And Liara. Uh, you've got some really sucky armor on. Let's see if we can find anything better. Apparently not. Looks like Caden and I are wearing the good stuff. But this one at least has better shields. I think it's pink though, that horrible pink one. This one has better shields and slightly... Hmm... Oh, pfft. That's, I was like, wait, how did I not notice that before? Because <laughs> she can't wear it. Uh, yeah, go with this one. I think that'll be fine for you for now. Um, okay. Let's see, pistol. Uh, where is this one? There you go. That's for you. And that'll do. Alright, I'm not actually going to sell stuff right now because I don't care enough to do it. Let's go have a chat with Caden. Oh wait, I forgot to check the armor thingamajigger for both of them. Armor thingamajigger. Here you go. And Liara. Your armor thingamajigger also really sucks. Here you go. Yay! Now to go find Keaton. Activate, please. Okay. Up we go. Okay, done. I would like to have a chat with you as soon as the game is done loading. Okay. Let's go have a chat with Kaden. Hello. Do you have some time to talk now, Commander? Absolutely, I'm listening. Personal crap, not interested. Uh, sure. Of course. Have a seat. <laughs> played it pretty close to the book so far, but we're a long way from backup. We've got some tough calls to make. I'm just saying, try to leave yourself a way out. I've seen what cutting corners can do, and I'd hate to have that happen to you, Shepard. Okay. 
<laughs> Shepard, how informal. Are you concerned for me? I don't need approval. Uh, this one? That's not the appropriate way to address your commanding officer, Lieutenant. I wasn't speaking to you as my commanding officer, ma'am. I, I don't want to send any bad signals. Just, uh, working on what I've picked up. You tell me if I'm going too far. We'll see. What's your logic? Stop being vague. I guess we'll see. We haven't had much off-duty time to talk. You have an issue with how things are going? I'm not questioning any decision you've made, Shepard. Let me be clear about that. It's just my experience that once someone lets something slide, it tends to pick up speed. You get my meaning? Bad experience. You have an example. No, cut to the chase. This one? Talk to me, Caden. You got a little black rain cloud sitting over <laughs> I'll try to keep the deck dry. <laughs> you know the records about the biotic training out on Jump Zero? They're all classified. Because the Alliance made mistakes. Uh-oh. 